Hey everybody, what's going on? Welcome back to another reaction. We have two videos for number I today. The only reason why I'm not doing their latest release, Bond and Blue Ear cover, in one video is because recently I've been getting a lot of copyright blocks and I don't want to risk it, which is why I would rather split these two music videos into two separate reaction videos instead of do one as I would usually do. Very, very excited because I actually missed the fact that number I released this music video for Blow Your Cover. There's also a performance video that we are going to be checking out after the official music video. It looks actually quite serious, very different from GOAT. So I'm very, very, very excited in terms of like the title of this video, Blow Your Cover. I feel like this, there's probably some you know, uh, sneakiness happening within a relationship or not being very real with the partner, one-sided relationship, who knows? With that being said, let's get into Number Eyes Blow Your Cover, the official music video. Whoa. Is it weird that I thought of Jackson Wang just now? Like, did, did, it's not like he looks necessarily exactly like him, but like the hair and everything just... Damn. Whoa. Okay, we went from goat... <laughs> to goats of acting. Jesus. Damn, this is... This is sensual. Very poetic lyrics. The tears through the fabric was really, really cool. Damn. 
Whoa. This was so different. God damn. And none of it really existed. That's interesting. So it was all like a metaphor. This music video was incredibly artistic. The actual storytelling here and the, the sensuality and the intimacy that they portrayed here was definitely something that was very, very different for me because the only thing that I know about them is GOAT. I've seen a bunch of their, you know, YouTube uh, shorts, like the GOAT challenges, them kind of like being super playful, goofing around, doing the choreo, doing, yeah, just being super relatable, really. And I really, really enjoyed them. Uh, and then seeing a completely different side of them here, which was almost like sexual, sensual, intimate, and vulnerable is the biggest thing. Like they were not afraid of like showing vulnerability to such an extent where they're literally crying. They're literally like a uh, hi Hirano, Sho, Sho Hirano um, was drowning in that tub. You know, uh, you watch uh, the, the first member who is watching the, the woman leave the bed and she's leaving like in in what looks like the same colored outfit as the rest of the dancers. So, and you don't see her face as well. So it's almost as if like this music video depicts a clusterfuck of emotions on the side of the woman that the man cannot figure out. It's almost as if like, I'm falling in love with you to such a, to such an extent where when you leave me, I am literally on the verge of tears. I want to drown much like in that tub. I am not myself. I'm losing all of my senses and I'm losing control of reality. And all I want to do is just for you to be real with me. So I just want you to blow the cover and just, you know, uh, take that fabric off because I want to get to know the real you. But the reason why I cannot, the reason the second they pull off the, the cover and it was a really nice uh, nice touch to pause the music completely as he pulls the cover off and the women start dancing to almost like express like a bit of a clusterfuck of emotions almost to represent that you never know what she the female interest is thinking about like she's not potentially even being honest or she's being at the very least not as into him, not as into them as they are into her. Um, so it almost like shows a relationship when one person became so attached to a point where the attachment creates a detachment because the other person could be a little bit like, oh, hold up, you're way into me. This is way too early. I'm not ready for this. And you kind of like subconsciously starts to start to distance that person who would literally give their life for you, you distance yourself because you don't, you feel pressure. You feel as if like you are kind of like drowning in all of this love that they want to give you. They just want you to be real with them, with them, but their reality is going to be brutal to the guys because they potentially do not feel the same way towards the men as the women, as, as the men feel towards the women in this context, which is why they're, they're almost are like the ones who are being like emotional, crying, drowning in that tub, constantly chasing that feeling. Sorry, that's a <laughs> TXT pun. Uh, chasing the emotions of the women, trying to understand them and get to know them and try to actually get a real connection. Because the, 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 the it's almost like the, the attachment grew further as the music video starts because it expresses both the men and the woman being in bed. It already shows like the aftermath, like they, they, they've already slept together. So the attachment is like, okay, I am, I'm feeling some type of way about this person. And that person just walked away literally without any feelings, not even looking back at me. So it's almost like a representation of the woman being almost kind of like, not wanting to show her true emotions because she may not actually have those emotions to begin with. 
that will correspond or correlate with the emotions of the male in this particular relationship. Actually, low key, this is quite uh, refreshing to see, you know, uh, the guys for a change being the ones who are incredibly vulnerable, incredibly like so consumed by someone that they want something real, but they cannot get it because, you know, all those feelings are literally and figuratively and metaphorically are covered up. Like that fabric is basically like a fabrication of, of feelings. Um, and I, the more chocolate lyrics actually reminded me of the movie Chocolate with Johnny Depp, uh, which is super, super romantic, more sweetness, more, you know, um, and whatnot. Uh, and like chocolate, the complexity of chocolate as well is, is pretty, pretty cool. Uh, but yeah, the, this music video was... Uh, was really really uh, wonderful. Maybe I, I, maybe I'm getting a little bit ahead of myself, and this is not the meaning. But it it feels like the interesting part is like the the guys always see the women as they're dancing. I'm guessing that the dancing is like a representation of like the the emotions that both the women and maybe even the men experiencing because the men are seeing them, the guys are seeing them. Uh, and then they're not, then they disappear. The women disappear towards the end of the music video. They're, they're by themselves. So it's almost as if it creates like another, like psychological layer of the guy seeing the women everywhere, everywhere I look, your scent was left. Your touch was left. Like I, I am obsessing over you. Um, that's at least how I kind of, uh, take it, but like. And like the tear behind the fabric was really, really, really interesting because it's almost like maybe the relationship is, maybe there is some love that the woman's perspective is, is giving, but at the same time, maybe the tears are representing the fact that I don't feel that same way towards you, if that makes any sense. Like, I don't want to hurt you, so I would rather mask it and not blow my cover. Because you're not going to like what is underneath potentially because there's not enough love for the both of us that I can give you uh, or something along those lines. I, I'm not really sure, honestly. Let me know in the comment section. Uh, but uh, this music video was incredibly artistic. I'm very, very excited to to dive into the performance video. So with, with that being said, let's do that. Looks like the apartment is completely abandoned, or the house, rather. Uh, wiping the the knee was really really interesting. Ooh, I love the letting go of the hands on the beat. I really love like even uh like the hand gestures is so like not minimal it's elegant it's like it's not it, it's not it's it's such a contrast obviously goat was a completely different song it was like very powerful and dynamic and super snappy whereas this is like super like the the movements are like so elegant and like so like a, a legitimately they make it feel so incredibly um intimate and, uh, but they still have like that dynamic like to go from one move to the next it, it's so it's still snappy but the fluidity is really really beautiful like the hip movement 
That smile was uh, after this. Yeah. Ooh. the way they broke that flow as two were dancing and one was just walking by. Ooh, damn. Oh, that was a triple spin. That was really, really beautiful. There's something about the fact that the apartment is, the, the house is, is empty and abandoned. Like it, it legitimately looks like, you know, chairs are being thrown around in the background. You know, the walls are a little bit messed up on the side of the window. I don't know how far do we want to take it in terms of like the house representing like the the relationship that is kind of like broken because you know she's not gonna blow that cover she's she's not going to reciprocate which is why like the the intro to the original music videos like the outro like they're crying because they left and it, because the woman left without even looking back in some capacity um but like to me it legitimately feels like a, an expression of like two people being together and one is way more attached than the other which creates a major attachment which kickstarts a detachment from the other party because they're so kind of like distancing themselves from that person in some way because they feel like this is this is way too much this is too this, this is too emotional. They're, they're, he's too into me. He's too, like, it, it, it like creates this bit of like, if the two people are not 100% in love with one another, it, it, it's going to make the other person feel a little bit awkward and almost like distance themselves from that other person who is so madly in love with them. Uh, and then it's going to create the feeling of like, oh, hey, I love her so much, but she just grows her distance away from me more and more and i feel like the more i love her the less i even understand her because she's like not being truthful with me there's all kinds of like things happening in your mind where you you become paranoid and you become become kind of like you're overreacting potentially and all because at the end like you're too much for that person potentially i'm not not really sure i mean we've seen those kinds of relationships obviously depicted in like in real life in movies and tv shows and whatnot like it it, it definitely uh it is a very kind of like mature theme that i feel like they are uh dealing with here and it was also really really nice uh like to see kind of like uh the the guys be the ones who are like on the more emotional side the 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 vulnerable side um i thought it was really really re refreshing so uh yeah overall this was absolutely beautiful the choreo was really really sensual elegant and still incredibly like snappy like that triple spin uh with uh with hirano show was really really uh beautiful and uh you know some of the the, the smiles uh after like that was really really like very very seductive like they they really play a lot on like the vulnerable and the sensual theme uh quite well um and and that's that's beautiful because like in goat they they look so fucking ecstatic and enthusiastic and playful like i would not imagine them doing this kind of concept if if i had to guess what was going to be their next concept i would not guess like sexy and sensual even though they're absolutely they're obviously like good looking dudes and whatnot 
And clearly their core, uh, their moves are, you know, they got them. But still, like, go left such a mark on me that I wasn't expecting this kind of side from them. So this was beautiful. Hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. Stay tuned for the reaction for Number Eyes Bon as well. It's going to be released around the same time as this video. If you did enjoy this reaction and if I made any sense, let me know in the comment section down below. Make sure to like this video. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. And I will catch you all in the next one. Be well and safe wherever you are.